All right, got a very shocking clip from a Calvinist preacher known as James White. I showed this before, but in this clip, he literally says that child molestation and child rape is God-ordained. Because you see, in Calvinism, they think everything is God's will. So if everything that happens is God's will, including sinful actions, which they've said as well, uh, that means that basically when a child was, you know, when a Catholic priest, you know, molests a child, that was God's will, apparently, you know. It's a it's a wicked false doctrine, but I'm going to show this clip. This is James White saying essentially that the God of Calvinism ordains child rape. Watch this. When a child is raped, is God responsible and did he decree that rape? If he didn't, then that rape is a, a, an element of meaningless evil that has no purpose. What I'm trying to point out by going to Scripture... So what is your answer there? Because I, I want to understand the answer I'm to that question. I'm trying to go to Scripture to answer the Yes, but the what reason, is the answer to the question that the, he just asked so easy, that we can understand what the answer is? I, I, I mentioned to him, yes, because if not, then it's meaningless and purposeless. And though God knew it was going to happen, he created without a purpose. If you didn't need any more proof that the God of Calvinism is a false God, the God of Calvinism is not the God of the Bible, there you go. And here's proof that the God of Calvinism is a false God. Okay, Matthew chapter 18, verse 6. God, God did not ordain child molestation. Give me a break, that's disgusting. Matthew chapter 18, verse 6. But whoso shall offend one of these little ones which believe in me, it were better for him that a millstone were hanged about his neck, and that he were drowned in the depth of the sea. Matthew chapter 18, Verse 10, Take heed that you despise not one of these little ones, for I say unto you that in heaven their angels do always behold the face of my Father which is in heaven. And Matthew chapter 18, verse 14, Even so, it is not the will of your Father which is in heaven that, the, that one of these little ones should perish. That's simple. God is not for this kind of wicked sin of child abuse and child molestation. But the Calvinist God is. That's how we know the Calvinist God is a false God. It's a, it's a devil when you get down to it. It's a devil spirit that inspired Calvinism. So just wanted to show you guys that. Right there, Calvinism exposed. The God of Calvinism is a God of sin. The God of Calvinism is a God. See, when Calvinists pray, thy will be done, they're basically praying you know, for children to be, be raped by Catholic priests, essentially. So anyway, don't be deceived. May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ be with all the brethren. Goodbye. Thank you.